Hello, Mark here with part two of the Crystal Cave series. I really hope you enjoyed part one. I won't keep you waiting any longer. On to part two. Just a fair warning, for some reason, the next 20 feet is a cell phone magnet. We lose more cell phones in the next 20 feet than we do anywhere else in the cave. They usually, usually retrieve them, but of course, about that time, the only thing left is the SIM card. <laughs> <laughs> so, do they find them when they clean? No, actually, if somebody tells us they drop it, maintenance will come in and look for it. And like I said, they usually find it, not all of them, because there are some places there that it goes pretty deep. A column forms. When the stalactites and the stalagmites meet in the middle. This is our totem pole. If you look right up here, it looks like there's a bunch of faces carved in it looking yep. back at us. Yep. Yeah, it's here. I heard a bunch of people mention the puddle of water right there. Yeah. Right down here. This is the largest body of water in the cave. It's only three and a half quarts. There used to be a big spring up below us, but it dried up for some reason. This water is important. This is the water they used for the baptisms down in the ballroom. This formation right here is our sand castle. It is just a stalagmite, but if you notice, it's dull. It's not wet, and there is no stalactite above it feeding it. This is a dead formation. They believe during that earthquake, this rock shifted right here. They believe it used to be here, underneath this broken off stalactite. This is slowly becoming more and more hollow from the inside out, and one day it will collapse and fall. Across a bridge made out of steel. Can't be slippery, especially first thing in the morning. Hold on. Right above the lion's tail, we have a lion. 
Oh wow, that does look like a lion. Yeah, As we move on, we're going past the crystal cage with Shiro. Anybody that wants to make a wish, close your eyes and make a wish. But don't tell anybody what your wish is or it will not come true. Yeah, it's hard to see the dollars. Oh, you don't look with their eyes at them. Oh, yeah. This is really cool. Salted yes, caramel is. ice cream. Definitely job of the hut. Yeah. Definitely. And right here is my buddy Jack Frost. Everybody knows that Jack Frost, when he breathes, he breathes ice. Look around his nose and mouth, and up on the ceiling of the cave, it looks like ice. This is the unscientific reason why it's always 54 degrees in the cave. It looks like mar marble cake right there.
cool little miniature golf course here. Uh, so when you're done exploring the cave, you can actually go and play some miniature golf. It is closed right now, though, but it actually looks like a pretty pretty neat course here. I love miniature golf and uh, not very good at it, but it is a lot of fun. Anyway, guys, if you enjoyed the video today, please hit that like button. And like always, please subscribe. Thanks again for watching.